All right, guys, if you've ever wanted, all right, with iOS 10, I know this wasn't possible before, but I want to share with you something today that's really, really cool. With iOS 10 now, you can share a voicemail with anyone you want. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. I've got my <clears throat> phone application loaded, and I'm in the voicemail list, and I'm going to open up one that I already have here. More info. Sylvia Palomino, mobile, Sunday, 11 seconds. And I'm going to double, double tap on that. Row expanded. And then I'm going to voicemail, report feedback. Play. I'm going to left flick here because I want to get back to the top here where the name is. Transcription, not a, more info, button. Share, button. Selected, pause, nest, more info, button. Inactive, unplayed, Jesse Hernandez, more in, selected, pause, message. Sylvia Palomino, mobile, May 14th, 2017 at 5.51 p.m. Okay, so? Share button. There's the share button. Let's double tap. Share. Airdrop recipient. No one found yet. Image. All right. I'm going to show you what type of file it creates. Airdrop. Message button. Mail button. Add to notes button. Cancel button. I'm going to find Dropbox here. More. But save to drop. Add to save to Dropbox button. I'm going to double Dragable. tap. I'm going to double tap on that. Cancel button. And I'm gonna look at the file name. Voicemail dash one eight zero dot four eight text field. Save location heading. My work only you. All right, I'm gonna top double tap on that. My work only you. Save voicemail dash one eight zero dot four eight text field. Okay, let's look at that file heading. And I'm left flicking here. Save button. By the way, I'm using an iPhone seven plus with iOS ten, the latest update as of this video. Save to Dropbox. He save button. I'm gonna double tap on that. Say, uploading, uploading, greeting, dimmed button. I'm sure you heard my computer in the background. I got the voicemail. Voicemail heading. And that completes this quick tutorial. If you want to share your voicemails on your iPhone 7 Plus, then you could do that with iOS 10. And all you got to do is go to the phone application, tap on voicemail, expand the voicemail that you want, and double tap on the share button. All right, this is Jose Tamayo for the Blind Tech channel. If you have any questions, please feel free to post it down below or email us at blindtechchannel, tech is spelled T-E-C-H, blindtechchannel at gmail.com. Thank you.